Now, during a brief breakfast meeting at the Vancouver summit, Seoul's foreign minister Kang Yonghua met with her Japanese counterpart Taro Kono. The two are said to have exchanged their government's positions on the controversial joint 2015 agreement on the issue of Japan's wartime sexual enslavement of Korean women. Kang reiterated that Korea does not consider the deal a resolution of the issue and explained that Seoul would use its own money to compensate the victims rather than use the money provided by Tokyo. Kono said Japan rejects that stance, adding that Tokyo cannot accept Seoul's demands, such as asking for Prime Minister Shinzo Abe to apologize. They are also said to have discussed the possibility of Abe attending the 2018 PyeongChang Winter Olympics, and Kono said Tokyo would make a decision soon.